Hey guys, welcome back to Resident Evil 4. Last time we re-encountered Bjorts Mendez and cleared out the sewers, and we are about to face down one of the most fearsome villagers. And uh, let's just go ahead and reload our shotgun. You're gonna need it. Villager Scurry. Yeah, he's um be a bit of an asshole. But before we leave, if you open this up, you get a random chicken egg. Just get a bacon and egg. And if you run over here. And you slice this open, you get... Grandma's family grenade! You get an incendiary <laughs> grenade. And, um, and here you also get some macetas. She makes her delicious grenade pie with it. <sighs> okay, and now we are going to face down <laughs> Dr. Salvador. Or another Salvador, I should say. It's one way to do it. Yep. And uh, we've got a uh, hand grenade, but... Oh, Grandma's family yeah. grenade! The incendiary is probably going to do a little bit better against this guy since it's just one. We're not looking for group Stun. damage. And it stuns him nicely. Yeah, it stuns him so you can get in a good shotgun blast. Um, he's almost dead. Yeah, he's getting close. If he's not oh, dead yet, he's going to probably one, two more oh. shots. Um, he's going to run at us again. I'm just going to back off. Let him clear up. The closer he gets, the good thing about Sal is that he is a huge target, and he went down pretty easy. He is, when he gets close, if you let him get close enough so that he's in shotgun range without being close enough to, of course, lock your head off, then um, he's pretty easy. He's got a really huge area for that shot. Let's go ahead and knock that down, and I think we got a spinal. And we are going to fight some more villagers here. Yeah, he does work pretty nice with the buckshot sponge. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and knock him down. Slice. And dead. Alright, coming up, we have. Well. One. What is it? We've already made, in this LP alone, we've had a Coney joke. It was a women's rights joke about why she wasn't in the kitchen. Alright, alright. Better that you didn't make it. Alright, team team. Alright, so here's a big group of Ganadas. If you're easily offended, you probably the actual offensive you. stuff. If you're easily offended, watch the first episode and then skip on the ones where Michael and Eli are the present. <laughs> I haven't said anything before. Oh god! Yeah, uh, except for that Naruto joke. Oh, so hold on, let me say this. Yeah, Jackson? We got the viewer and motherfucking game for that. Boom! Yeah! That means more than I subscribed. Well, we also have a new guy that I didn't know who he was. What, the guy that watched the Pokemon vids? No, that kind That fucking asshole did not subscribe. Yeah. Great, now we're gonna have to completely scrap that part of it. <laughs> Dude, you are not an asshole, just so you know. I don't even remember your name because it wasn't my video in, in all cool honesty. Guy. I don't have I don't check through the videos very very often, so um, it's it's all Pokemon. Everyone it everyone so okay. Before. Yeah, that's true. Sir who first commented on the Pokemon videos, let Red Spire formally apologize for the unprofessional behavior of Jackson, because Jackson is the asshole. <laughs> Jackson <Fucking> also... <laughs> now Jack we don't have to scrap it. He's gonna fire our asses. He also has the controlling interest in the channel. I'm that dick boss. <laughs> dick boss. We don't <laughs> conjoined dick boxes. All right. How do you have conjoined dicks? <laughs> Very carefully. <laughs> Yes, I am to get and now, before this can get any more derailed, we're gonna go ahead and unbar the door and wait for Michael to stop laughing like an idiot. And we are back in the village. Guess they came back from church. And um, yeah, they did. And in force. <laughs> if you, this village is going to have, I believe that they will continually spawn. So there's no way to clear the village out. Really. Kind of absorb all and the pellets there. If you know, and I'm not I'm going to save ammo in this village. I'm just going to blast these guys out and use my hand grenade. Actually, you know what? I can just flash. flash grenade because okay. we're going to flash grenade. We're going to just knock those guys back and we're going to run through the rest of the village. Where do you have to go to the church, right? Yep. And uh, we get to we get to see the merchant again soon. That's very nice. Never underestimate the kick. It's got a great area of effect. Yeah, it'll. 
We got a couple of guys in an area that kick all decent. It'll do decent damage. It won't kill anything, usually, but it'll it'll knock him down and it'll give you a chance to run for it if you need to. And, uh, screw those guys. They can't get in because they don't have the key. So are we actually going to buy the TMP this time, or...? Uh, yeah, I w this is usually where I buy it because I'm usually running out of ammo at this point. Let me go ahead and save, and... You gonna upgrade anything, or you just... There's not... I mean, I'm not gonna keep... I'll get into it when we get to the version again. Sure. Yep. There we go, some TNT ammo right off the bat. There's spinal in there, I want to say. Yep. Yep. Uh, the first time there's a spinal, next couple of times there's nothing. Right, we're gonna go ahead and jump down here and check the wall barriers. Yeah, there are um, there are boxes. There's a box in one of these, but to be honest. It, it doesn't even, it's not, oh, there it is. It's a lot easier than I thought it was. In, in here, there are two spinals and an even better piece of loot. Not to mention there's one right above your head. Yeah, the Three. one above my head is the best piece of loot in here, is the elegant headdress. It's one of two or three in this game. And then over here, we've got two more spinals, I believe. Spinals, or how do you say it? Pink it's gonna crystal be, that's thingies. Gonna be, yeah, pink crystal thingies. That's going to be my running thing for this series, because... I haven't been able to get away from saying spinals, and I'm almost sure it's spinal or some shit. And, uh, it doesn't matter. And we're gonna get nothing. Woo! I got a prize. Another Wait. empty box. At least it's not a snake. And. Got something that might interest you. Good going on. <laughs> Shield your eyes! Got a selection. And his list updates. So, now you have more stuff to buy. And here you can buy the stock for the TMP now, which is what I was waiting for. And, uh, the reason is that the TMP without... You may think that the TMP on its own, uh, you may be of the opinion that it really isn't all that bad. I think it is. It really bothers... It does make a difference for what me. Are you buying? Maybe it doesn't for you. I don't know. What I'm going to go ahead buying? and buy the TMP here. Do you have enough in your case first? I'm gonna have enough room. I'm just gonna rearrange. rearrange stuff, and I'm gonna sell those rifle bullets anyway. <laughs> Thank you. What are you selling? And uh, let's go ahead and sell off all our stuff. You should have a pretty good collection of stuff to sell by now. Um, Is that all? Gonna get ten thousand off spinals. Ten thousand off rubies. Ten thousand off that, and ten thousand off the elegant headdress. So, a lot of cash. yeah, plus, I think about 750, yeah, 750 on the rifle ammo. So we've got quite a bit of cash now, so I think that we can upgrade something. And we're going to start off by upgrading our TMP, because it's one of the few guns that I'm going to keep all the way throughout this uh, Let's Play, because it doesn't lose its usefulness. And we're going to go ahead and buy the upgrade of the attaché case, because we're going to need it to get the stock as well, because we're going to run out of room. Um, oh, and, first aid spray? Yeah. Always, first aid spray, buy it whenever you can. It's, a good, it's always a good idea to have first aid spray as a backup to your herbs and your eggs. Or this one. <laughs> so there we go. We now have a new gun added to our collection. One of the, one of my favorites in this game, at least. When's, uh, when do we start shooting blue things again? Uh, we start shooting blue things in the next area. Isn't that the graveyard? Yep, it's the uh, church's graveyard, and um, Ooh, fun. I yeah, this, this and, is not, yeah. It, it's not that bad. Um, well, we do gain an uh, an accomplice, don't we? Um, not yet. Remember. Not yet. That's. I think that's when you're coming back. Yeah, it's. Yeah, that's on the trip back. Disregard that. Bird All right, nest. Up here. Don't you get a cat's eye from the bird nest? No, you get more rifle. You get uh, it's random ammo from the chest uh, from the from there. Sometimes it's uh sometimes it's it can be from like hand ammo to a grenade. So sometimes you're real lucky you'll get a hand grenade. Sometimes you'll end up well. I won't say you're on. Oh, oh hey, <laughs> speak the devil. <laughs> Hell yeah, another hand grenade. You're a lucky ducky today. <laughs> kind of. For those of you who haven't figured it out yet, I am a big fan of hand grenades. I am do a shit ton of damage and. I'm just gonna try to pick off as many of these birds as possible without. And if you're paying any attention, you probably just heard a female villager. She's around here somewhere. She'll probably pop up and oh, fucking yeah, hit us. No. And there's her son or somebody. I'm sure that everyone in this town is fucking related in some way or another. Oh, there she is. Oh, really? 
was gonna take a look. He actually just shot my ba the back of my neck open. Oh god. And she throws oh, shit. shit. That was not lucky at all. Yeah, she. I hate, I hate the fucking bags for the villagers because they are. Um, I'm gonna wait for a minute to do that. One thing to note on the TMP, once you tune it up, it kind of chews three bosses too. Uh, or at least some of the sub bosses, that is. Yeah, it won't. The TMP is not not a boss one at all. It really should be avoided for most big boss fights, but for smaller boss fights like Sal, um, he, it's okay. It, I still would recommend the shotgun for the chainsaw guys or Sal. Or Shotgun is just useful for anything. Yeah, shotgun is just your all around. Shotgun will be used for bosses, it'll be used for sub bosses, it'll be used for thinning out crowds. It's really. The shotgun is the most versatile weapon you're gonna get. But, um. Let's go ahead and knock down the guys who are up here. And, you know, I think that it's about time to show off the EMP, so let's do that. And, uh, there are three guys up here. Uh, well, we got to show off the TMP there, guys. Two bullets fired. And um I switch right back out into the handgun. That guy kind of exploded, so uh Are we gonna hit the medallions now? Um we're gonna hit the medallions in the uh what time are we at right now? You can go ahead and say it, Jack. I mean I already asked the question. Eleven? Okay. We are going to hit the medallions in the next episode. Um I'm just gonna go ahead and kill these guys back here and I believe we'll Yeah, we'll end it off and uh and uh, we'll end it off, and we will, next time on Resident Evil 4, we will be tackling the medallions of the churchyard.